Hi, I'm Dennis Lovelady. I added a GoPro camera with wireless microphone to my golf car using Wix. Let me show you how I did it. Okay, technically I didn't use Wix. To get started, I needed this specialized mount that I found on Thingiverse. I'll leave a link in the description. This is a GoPro mount that has slots on the sides, and into those slots will go these two bolts. And I have two washers and two nuts for those two bolts. In addition, I needed to be able to move the camera from front to back view, so I found this swivel mount used on eBay for a good price, and so it became part of my kit. Here is a rare look at my wireless receiver. The reason I'm showing you this is that I needed some way to mount this near the camera. Looking in my pile of junk, I found this, which I used to use for mounting my phone on the vent of my car. And I decided, hmm, that looks like about the right size. Let's see if it will work. And sure enough, the receiver fits in there perfectly. It's held tightly. I don't have to worry about it falling. All I need to do is modify this. That modification was going to be a piece of cake because all I had to do was slide this out like this, slide this out like this, and pop this out like that. And now I have a nice flat surface. And looky here, I even have a place where I can mount the bolts to fit on the golf car. So now all I need besides that is a couple of more bolts, a couple of more washers, and a couple of more nuts. This is the whole kit that we will need to install on the golf car. Let's get started. direction. Let's turn the camera on so we can see what we're dealing with here. There we go. So I can point this at the, at the people having fun inside the car. And I can also point it at the people having fun outside the car. How about that noise? All right. So let's uh, take it for a drive, shall we? So this is not the most ideal day for a golf car trip, I promise you that. We, uh, it's a little cold, a little cloudy. I don't think there's any chance it'll rain today, but on the other hand, I wouldn't bet against it. Let's turn that camera around. You don't want to see me. You want to see where we're going. So do I. There we are. And I also want to see how the stabilization is going to work on this camera. Here we go. So I have just about probably 15 to 20 miles per hour here. And 
this golf car, this particular golf car, is pretty fast and the top end's about 25 miles per hour. It is just a little bit cool today. I think I said that. We're going to uh, just go up the golf car path, turn around and come back because the golf car path gives us a great indication of how good the stabilization is. And this windy, cold day will give us a great indication of how the sound and the lavalier mic and the dead cat work together. Hoping that it's quite reasonable. The indications are that it should be because I have had uh, good success with this combination before. Just introducing the golf car as a new uh, mix. So we'll see how that works out. This golf car path is not maintained by the city of Peachtree City. Instead, it's maintained by the neighborhood in which I live, the Landing Subdivision. Because until you get to Sumner Road, you aren't technically in Peachtree City. This is still Fayetteville. And Fayetteville doesn't have official golf car paths. But what they do do, is they allow a golf car on this particular road. And when you take this road down to the right, down this direction, about a quarter mile, you run into Sumner Road, Peachtree City. So there you go. So let's go back home. I'm really anxious to see this footage, to hear the sound. The golf car makes a lot of noise. That's just the way it is. Just the a clang of the springs as we go over each tree root. Overall, I'm completely satisfied with the result. I think the sound is fantastic. The wide view of that GoPro camera just adds so much. I like the flexibility of being able to turn the camera around. It's just, it's exactly what I was looking for. Hey, thanks so much for spending all this time with me. I know you had choices and I really appreciate you being here. And I hope you guys have a very, very happy Christmas and a Merry New Year. Yeah, that's it. <laughs>